going to show you a contraption that I've built. It's a pendulum. So we've got these two flexible pendulums joined end to end and they're attached to a jigsaw. Now I was inspired to build this when I met a mathematician called David Atchison. He's a brilliant speaker and a brilliant author, so you can check out his stuff in the description of this video. The idea with this pendulum is that you try and balance it upside down. Now that's a hard thing to do, and it's even harder if it's being moved. So it should be really hard if I turn the jigsaw on, because then it's going to get moved a lot and it's going to be incredibly unstable. But the surprising thing is, if you vibrate an upside down pendulum fast enough, it becomes stable. Now, it was already known that a single rigid pendulum could be made stable by vibrating it up and down. But what David Atchison did was work out the mathematics of multiple rigid pendulums joined together. And he showed that any finite number of pendulums joined together can be made stable in an inverted position. Not an infinite number of pendulums joined together. Um, I'm not sure what the issue is there. Maybe it's impossible to buy an infinite number of pendulums, uh, or maybe there's some mathematical reason, I don't know. But there it is, the inverted pendulum. And uh, if you want to know how I built it, keep watching. But that's the end of the video, really. Okay, you're still with me, good. So um, to build one of these things, well, this is how I did it. I bought some Meccano, very basic Meccano, just plastic stuff. Um, and I screwed several sections together. I didn't screw them uh, all the way to make them tight. There's still some give in there. Um, and then uh, I sealed that off using Araldite. So these things can't, uh, they can't get any tighter. They can't get any looser. That's exactly how I want it to be. I then took the, um, the saw bit of the jigsaw and I heated it with a blowtorch. I did that in a stand and, um, and it was hot enough so that when I pressed the, the uh, Meccano piece to it, it melted into it and so that's how that final seal was made and that is the inverted pendulum.